I've needed to remember this a million times in my life. I had the privilege of being raised in a loving Christian home. Not always getting to do what everyone else did growing up it was not always my favorite. But as an adult, I've learned that that was a blessing, not a curse. Um, as a child, my family, we moved around a lot, um, new places all the time, about every couple years. And the first thing my parents did was always find a church. We would get connected with the youth and the families. And so that was always important in our family. And as a child, I never really gave that any thought. It was just what we did. Um, as an adult, I realized, still moving around a lot, that that was important to everybody in the family and keeping us all centered. So we always did that as well. Um, we never lived by relatives a lot, so we found that a church family was the next best thing to physical family. So that was always very helpful in growing up. Um, like most, I've led far, far from a perfect life. Um, I've made mistakes along the way. Um, I accepted Christ as a small child. I was only nine. Back in the days when you got to get up and walk down the little aisle and profess your face in front of everybody. Um, so that was part. Um, I've strayed at lots of different times during my life. Um, but God always puts me back on the right path. He puts people in my, in my way to remind me of which way I'm supposed to be going and guide me in the right direction again. Um, there have been times when I chose to ignore that advice and have clearly made the wrong choices. But God has always been faithful to me and um, he's just always there. And in those times when I make those wrong choices, it always seems like every sermon, every Bible study you go to is like talking to you. And you're like, oh, yeah, I didn't get that. I see that now. And so I don't know how he can do that, but it does. It just always hits the mark on us. Um, Um, probably the biggest trial I had in my life was my divorce and at that time I truly did not want to do the right thing um, I had a lot of people in my life who gave me the right direction which I chose to follow not because I wanted to but because I knew it was the right thing to do um, I've had to ask for forgiveness time and time again in my life for different things that I've done. He always forgives you, which is great. And um, despite all the mistakes I have made, I've found that Christ has always blessed me. I'm absolutely amazed at where I am in my life right now, considering some of the things I've done in the past. But I have chosen to be faithful and do what I knew was right rather than what I wanted. Even though, you know, you, the social media, the world around me, Everybody's fine if that's what you want to do. But I knew in my heart that wasn't the right thing to do. So I've always tried to choose the right path. And God has been very faithful to me. And I just can't believe how good my life has been by just doing what I knew was right and not always following the easy path. Um, he always picks up the pieces and shows you the right way. And off you go on your little life. Um, I just, I guess my biggest thing is God is so faithful. Um, don't know what I'd do without him. Um, can't imagine those who try to live without him, how that even is possible. Um, it's just, I don't know, most of my life I just considered a, you know, it was just, that's my life, it was easy. Um, never had many huge trials in my life. And when one came along, I was glad to see that Faith was there and it, I knew what to do, it just took a little time to get there. And God is always faithful.